today uh -oh. we about to tell y'all what's been going on y'all it's been all bad <laughs> She a honey, she remind me of a pot. Like a diamond in the rush, she keep it sad. You ain't gotta worry, baby, girl, I promise. We go out and you don't have to spend a dollar. She a 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 She and if you're new here, welcome. My name is Kiana, aka Corey Brielle. And I'm KD. And today, today, uh -oh. we about to tell y'all what's been going on, y'all. It's been all bad. It's been yeah. all bad. So basically, we had a leak that happened in our apartment. We were at Piedmont Park and we got a phone call from the rental office and she was like um the neighbor upstairs had like uh it wasn't the water heater the water heater busted yes the water heater busted in the unit upstairs and we kind of got some of the aftermath for that yes a whole lot of the aftermath bed soaked mattress destroyed all kind of stuff ruined but it's all good because they was able to compensate us you know, yes we, we in the hotel we went yes. on our chair to come through <laughs> renter's insurance because if we didn't have renter's insurance i would have been really upset mm, right. highly upset they put us in a hotel as a matter of fact we were only supposed to be in this hotel for eight days, eight days. and they extended it for another two weeks right so that's good we don't even know if we want to be in another two weeks because our apartment would be good by then but right shoot right well. yep and on top of that, we also talked to the rent office and they're gonna take a little bit off of the rent too for the inconvenience because they need to. So that's another cut it, thing. Cut it, cut it, right. <laughs> cut it. So yeah, y'all, um, if you ever go through a situation like this, you know, this is kind of a tutorial, you know, like a, a brief summary of, you know, the way you go about it um, and how we did it, you know. It was something that we never uh, went through to this extent. And um, it was a learning experience for both of us. You know what I mean? And for anybody, you know, who goes through that, just always remember, and this goes with anything in life, business, whatever it is. It's not what you... <laughs> Go ahead. It's not what you negotiate. It's what you... Oh. No, it's, it's a, not. It's not what you deserve. It's, it's what, what you, you negotiate. negotiate. <laughs> I knew you were you about remember to say that, that. If you remember that, you'll do good in life. It's not what you deserve, it's what you negotiate. Always. So you gotta speak up to get what you want. You can't just yeah. think automatically like, oh, I'm supposed to get this, oh, I'm supposed to get that. No, you gotta talk. Right. The money talks. Yep. So yeah, it's a nice day out here. You know, the weather's nice. Yeah, it's about it's 70 today. degrees. Right. Yeah. And we're finally getting out of the hotel. Yeah. We're finally getting ahead of the hotel. Well, we've been we're, getting out. Yeah, well, not really. I ain't been no prison. I've been out. Like, we're finally getting out today. We've been dealing with the adjuster and going back and forth from the house to the apartment and stuff. So we're finally getting out and doing something for ourselves. And we're going to get some sushi. Get some sushi. I can't I'm wait. I'm so hungry. And we uh, ain't had sushi in a while. We haven't had sushi in months. Months. That'd be delicious. Yes. I am feeding. 
Yep, and we decided to walk because it's not that far, which is so crazy, right? We stay downtown and we never really walk anywhere for real. We're always driving everywhere. And we have the luxury of just walking five minutes, not even five minutes up the street, like just two minutes to, to places. And mm -hmm. you know, we don't do that. So I just thought it was nice for us to get out today and go for a walk. Yep, it's right. like a 15 minute walk to the sushi place. And I can get some nice, some exercise. <laughs> Y'all, we just got the rice sushi. You know what I mean? We haven't had this in a while, like we told y'all before. But um, we was gonna touch back up, you know, kind of on the leak and stuff that we had in the apartment. And um, it just was a lot, you know. At the end of the day, I mean, the main thing that what you were saying about the clothes. What were you saying? They did our laundry. Yeah, they did yes. our laundry. I'm they did about. our laundry because some of our clothes had got wet and yeah. some shoes and hats and stuff. Super cheap. I don't know if it was the person we had or what. I don't know what it was, but they were just trying to salvage everything. Like, I'm sorry, I like jump all over the place. Let, let's get back to laundry because I was getting ready to go to the mattress. But uh, for the laundry, some of our stuff got wet, and they were like, "Oh well, we have a cleaning service." Um, they got. See, it's smart because they keeping everything in house. Yeah. Everything in house, you know what I mean? So that way, can't nobody go to another outside party. Everything is in house. So if you need your clothes clean, they're not doing it. Oh, we can go call mom and pops. And they cleaning your drawers, all that. Oh, your drawers. Oh, this got wet. That they getting everything. They coming through. They bringing the people in. They got their gloves on and they going in. Like I, I wasn't prepared for that. I know she wasn't. But uh, they, they was only for that. Did they clean any of my drawers? Yeah, probably. You gave them. My I don't drawers? know though. No, oh I don't God. think so. Cause you the one that put the stuff in the bag. I don't think nothing. So we got our Tokyo, Tokyo. tea here. This is my favorite drink. It's good. It is good. It's so good. Yeah, it's so good. And also if you're wondering, because they don't really do Tokyo teas anywhere, but Tokyo tea is just like a blue MF or um a long like island. A long island. It's, like a long, like. it's basically a long island with Midori. Yeah, back to what we were saying, um, a lot of our clothes got wet, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of the stuff that was in the closet, in the baskets and stuff, um, even in the room, a lot of stuff got wet, and um, they ended up bringing in the cleanup team. They had a whole department for dry cleaners who worked through them, that came and pulled up and collected all the clothing, wrote it on the list, and got it clean. I'm telling you, man, all state they have gotten very, very smart when it comes to keeping everything in house. I'm like, dog, oh, man, they got a team for everything. They were so cheap. I'm gonna tell y'all how cheap they were. Y'all don't know how cheap they were? The pillows. The pillows. We was talking to the lady, right? And we on the phone, you know, we talking, yeah, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do that. And we was like, yeah, you know, our pillows got wet too. You know, she's like, oh, okay. So what we could do, one of the alternatives that we do, we could replace the cushions that are in the pillow and then we could replace the, I said, nah, you, nah. She was going overboard with that. Right. Like, there was no point in doing that. Replace the pillows. Yeah, who was about to sleep on that? y'all don't go ahead, go to Walmart, Target, go ahead, get them pillows. And, Cause it's gonna really cause more to do that. Like, you know what I'm saying? And she was talking about the mattress too. Mattress too. Like talking she was talking about, about saving the mattress. the mattress. I'm like, lady, you you is like, I'm not sleeping on it. You about to sleep on it? Cause she I'm not. Crazy. She probably gonna get a mattress from the thrift store. Like, nah, right. we spent some money for that mattress. She said something about getting a guy to suck up all the water right. that was, was in the mattress or something. She tripping something like crazy. this ain't she tripping, this ain't that. You know right. what I'm saying? That's the other one. We ain't doing that over here, like right. at all. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, you know, and then it's just crazy though because 
and I don't want to, I don't want to bring the race card in there, but it's just like the way them folks be dealing with black people is just kind of weird to me. You know what I'm saying? And I can tell weird. black people done kind of ruined it for others down the line because of the way how they was. They was so, you know, we talking about hotels and stuff. You know, we stay in the city. Right. It just was a lot of shots that was being taken, and they ain't really know that they in the presence of, you know, like middle, middle class, right. middle upper class almost. So. What did she say to you? She was saying like, um, she was saying like, oh when, yeah, depending on where you, where you stay, um, like for example, if your rent is seven hundred and twenty dollars, and I had to stop her right there. Hold on, ma'am. I rent ain't seven hundred and twenty dollars. Uh, you know what I mean? I don't know what she, like, I don't know what you want with that. So that was one thing. She took a shot, and then it was another thing um, that she was saying because she was trying to find hotels that had like kitchens and stuff in them, right. and I was just like. Well, we don't need a kitchen where well, we have a, a bigger selection of things we could pick from. Right. And then yeah. she was like, oh, well, we, um, you can't get a room, um, at the W or something like that, you know, $400 a night type. And I'm like, hold on, man, where, where you going with this? I ain't even talking about all that. I just saying from the choices that y'all gave us, that, that wasn't a good choices. And so I'm saying if we eliminate the kitchen, will we have more things to pick from? And she don't right. went to a whole nother way and right. I'm just like, like pump your brakes you know what I'm saying but I could tell she used to dealing with whoever she been dealing with and she bringing that energy towards anybody of that caliber you know what I mean and they just this one that right so I don't know man people, they just a lot of the people that they got they need to work on their people skills and understand that everybody is not on the same uh mentality or t type of time that people have been on like you know we ain't even known that we ain't even been greedy we just want y'all to make sure y'all compensate us and put us in something of our liking that we're used to. Right, and then that we feel comfortable in. Right. Because she only gave us two choices. And right. one of the choices was extended stay. And I was like, I don't want to stay. Well, it wasn't extended stay, but it was something it similar was something like that. It was something like that. It was you know. something like that. Anyways, guys, we get ready to enjoy our food. And we're going to go ahead and close out this vlog. We just wanted to really update y'all on everything that was going on. Really, I've just been really irritated for real. For real, but, right? We haven't been stressed, yeah. I guess so. But, anyways, we're getting ready to end this vlog. We hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Well, not really enjoyed the vlog because it wasn't really enjoyable, like that. But, you know, yeah. we'll see y'all next time. I'm about to enjoy the shrimp, oh, and uh, yeah. we'll see y'all next time. I'm about time. to enjoy my food. Cheers. But yeah, we'll see y'all. Till next time.